Well, here I am, another week gone. Um, I haven't posted recently, but it's because I was trying to shoot a short film. I was supposed to be shooting this weekend, and that didn't happen. Um, what happened was the lead that I thought I had uh, bailed on me, which, you know, they're not getting paid. Um, so you can't really blame them for if they decide not to do it. Uh, there's no contract in place or anything like that. It was just the short film I wanted to shoot that I'd written. Uh, it looks like I may have a lead now. Uh, we may be able to shoot next weekend. We'll see. And we'll go from there. I, uh, I'm hoping I do. I'd like to get this film made. Uh, as far as workouts, my job, I've been working a lot of overtime to the point where I'm getting home at 7, 8 o'clock at nights on my workout nights. And yeah, I didn't work out. Worked out yesterday morning. <clears throat> Plan on working out tomorrow, which is Monday. I have to work. Um, I just can't seem to get up early enough to work out right now. I don't know what the deal is. Uh, I, I guess it's because there's just no way for me to go to bed by 8 o'clock. <laughs> um, because I'd really, to get a workout in every morning, I'd have to, I'd have to be in bed at 8, 8.30 and sleep in before 9. And I just have not been able to do that because of my job. This job is still better than the last job I had as far as time goes, but um, right now we're going through a phase where it's eating up a lot of my... Now I'm getting overtime, which is great, um, but between that and school, which we had a break from, uh, really taking up my time. Now school, one of my classmates who's in her 50s uh, just had a massive, massive stroke. She, uh, she won't be finishing with the class. She may never be able to live by herself again. She may never be functional again. Uh, in a matter of a few minutes, her life has changed forever. Uh, she was not in great shape. She was in pretty, pretty much overweight, obese, a uh, nice lady, but her job was horribly stressful. And you add that with school, and stress can do terrible, terrible things to the body. She just proved that beyond a doubt. And, and if you're not physically uh, fit enough, your body can't handle that stress. It's one more reason just to stay with what I've been doing. I've noticed lifting heavy. My body's doing things differently. I mean, I'm putting on muscle mass, which is great, but I'm not sure about, I mean, weight is going to do whatever it does when you're putting on muscle mass. Uh, I'm trying to lose fat, but it's going to do its own thing. I'm trying to, I see changes, I just don't, it's hard to, to really calibrate exactly where I am. Because instead of doing a bulk and, and what do they call it, a bulk and cut, like a power lifter, I'm trying to do a, um, basically a reconfiguration. Uh, a, I'm trying to lose fat while gaining muscle, not just put on weight to gain muscle and then cut. So, we'll see how that works. But anyway, I'm hanging in there trying to stick with it. I have some off days, but I've just gotten to the point where when I have a, a day that doesn't work the way I want on diet or the way I want on workouts, I pick up and move on and go to the next day. I don't beat myself up over it. Uh, I'm in this for the long haul. So it looks like it's going to take a lot longer to get my date with Natalie Portman than I thought. And I, that was on my mind yesterday. I said, you know, this whole thing started with the idea, this whole website started with the idea that I would reach uh, a date with Natalie Portman a date that obviously I, I would be stood up on but that um, I would go treat myself to this big thing so yeah it's gonna take some time so those of you who are watching I, I hope you'll stick with me um, if you have just found me I hope you'll stick with me and those who aren't watching I, I wish you would <laughs> but that's what's going on right now I hope you make a great week and I will talk to you soon.